All right, hello everybody. How are we? Yeah, let's go. So excited to be back here uh, in the beautiful uh, committee and field. Um, and uh, for our final concert of what has proven to be uh, a very resilient 2022, I would say by our students. Um, they have continued to work incredibly hard and have shown so much resiliency and persistence that uh, it inspired me uh, to keep going even when, you know, times got a little tough for us with COVID coming back and back again. These kids always stepped up like it was nothing and continued to make amazing music. Uh, and I could not be more proud of them uh, for, for that. And, uh, you know, uh, they are, they're wonderful. So tonight's about them. And we're very excited to have this performance for you guys to showcase all of the talent we have at HHS, especially the talent of the unbelievable uh, senior class of 2022. Um, and uh, I know the Celtics are on at 9:10 tonight, so we're just going to try and click along here without too much transition time. Now, um, a few things. First of all, I'd like to thank. Uh, um, HMAPA for setting up and uh, setting up the food, the tickets, and uh, helping with the ice cream truck. Don't forget there is TC Scoops out there. They're going to be here till about 8 o'clock. I'll remind you guys that there's a last call for that. But um, again, you know, they'll be here about till about 8. So please feel free to go grab some ice cream and chill out in our little concession area over here. Um, it does get a little chilly when the sun goes down, so make sure you bring a sweater or at least something to put on when it gets a little chillier. And, um, I'd also like to thank, you know, Superintendent Cuska, the Assistant Superintendent Joni Menard for you know, their support this year, uh, Principal Bottomley, and all those folks that make uh, the administration at Austin High School that make our jobs easier. Um, uh, so, without further ado, I think we're going to begin first with, uh, uh, if you haven't noticed, the theme for our evening is decades, and Mr. Priest is going to be changing the year using the time on that clock over there, just for a little detail. Okay, so if you're ever curious where we are, uh, Mr. Kenneth, Kenny Priest is going to be changing the time to reflect the year. Okay, and we're doing chronologically tonight. This is the first time we've had this intense of a theme, and I'd like to thank our senior class um, for coming up with this theme. Uh, and uh, so, without further ado, uh, the... Waltz number two by Dmitry Shostakovich, presented by the HHS Concert Band.
I can do that. <laughs>
during all the chorus one time. <laughs> okay, are these good too? Yes, they are. Fabulous. Okay, thanks guys for bearing with us. Next up, we have uh, the wonderful T-Tone singing uh, I Get Around by the Beach Boys from uh, 1963 with our soloist, Junior Ryan Bosch. <laughs> Next up is our longest uh, piece of the evening, a uh, Beatles medley, including 15 different songs that I'm assuming most of you will know. And uh, at the end, there's a little bit of audience participation, so uh, please feel free to join in. I'm pretty sure you know the song, so I don't have to teach it to you. <laughs> I will gladly teach it to you, though. All right, ready, everybody?
All right, next up we have the incredible Dylan Brewster singing the Cold War. <laughs>
seniors, Jocelyn and Sophia. And this begins our Billy Joel segment of the concert. If you've noticed in the, uh, uh, in the uh, program, there's a lot of Billy Joel, and uh, he is timeless, so, you know. Here we go.
Next up we have the uh, Pink Panther uh, remix. We know that this was originally composed much earlier than 1976, but uh, this, this version of the uh, Pink Panther is much funkier and disco-y, so we felt it appropriate to move it to the 70s. Anyway, we hope you enjoy the Pink Panther theme by the HHS Jazz Band.
wake up the sound guy. Hello? There we go. Thank you. Okay. All right. Next up, we have Act Two performing the next segment of our Billy Joel concert, conducted by our wonderful senior, Maddie Blocker.
with a couple of wonderful instrumentalists. We have two Wolfgangs, Mia on drums, Greta on trumpet, Jennifer Andelman on trumpet, and Esme Pereira on saxophone. Yay! <laughs> Oh, no. 
it. Just a reminder, there's no food on the field. Water's cool, but no food. So if you need to want your ice cream, just go ahead and eat it over there. Um, second thing, uh, next up in our program, we have uh, uh, a wonderful recording by senior Amberly Holden, who also released an album this year. You can find it on Spotify. Woo! Um, and uh, the guitar was provided by the wonderful Mr. Sean Rooney, who I see back there. Wave your hand, Mr. Sean Rooney. Thank you so much. He teaches here at the wonderful high school. And as you can see, not just Mr. Bilodeau and I are musicians at high school. So, thank you very much and enjoy.
Okay, there's no speeches allowed, seniors, but this is um, one of our favorite things that we do. Um, it is an unbelievable journey. Um, you know, this is uh, uh, my first class ever when I, when I got hired. These are my freshmen. So I'm proud to say that they ended up pretty, pretty darn good, <laughs> I think. <laughs> yeah. But you'll still be in my heart, and my door is always open to all of you. Okay. Yes. Okay. Okay. So um, let's just get started. Um, all the way, Phoebe Drohan. Gary. 
Jocelyn Quinnen. Cardenas Lopez. Emmett O'Leary. Of course, she's last. Chloe Drohan. And uh, Ban has two seniors that we are missing, uh, and we need to uh, recognize them. Did we miss three? Oh, there's three. So, Isabella, Sanjana, and uh, Aiden Smith. We're missing them. And Annabelle, we're missing four. time for the class of 2022. Thank you to all the parents, too, for raising these beautiful children. Let's go. All right, and let's, let's just go on with the show. Zombie. Harmonics.
Next up, we have Dynamo, played by the HHS, the Jazz Bond.
Okay, so, I know you don't want to miss a thing, but, but uh, ice cream is closed up shop in 30 minutes. So, if you want to get a little treat, uh, go get it. Thank you. Next up, we have Chloe Drohan shredding Aerosmith.
I like I like to let Mr. Everard talk more because he's he's the vocalist so they're more used to that. Um, so uh, for our next concert band piece, uh, we have a student conductor, Mr. Sean Carey. Uh, we will be conducting uh, a Star Wars medley from Episode One, and it's pretty fun. So I will let them go to it. I love you, Sean. <laughs>
really popular and the other one's not. Follow my lead and you're gonna be popular. You're gonna be popular. Friends with a bike or horse, you'll be good at sports. But this way you got to know. This is the last part. You got it off below. Let it go. Be popular.
Delilah, what's it like in New York City? I'm a thousand miles away, but girl, tonight you look so pretty, yes you do. Times Square can't shine as bright as you, I swear it's true. Hey there, Delilah, don't you worry about the distance, I'm right there if you get lonely. Give this song another listen, close your eyes. My voice, it's my disguise. I'm by your side. Oh, it's what you do to me. 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 What you do to me. Hey there, Delilah, I know times are getting hard, but just believe me, girl, someday I'll pay the bills with this guitar, we'll have it all. Even more in love with me, you'd fall, we'd have it all. Hey there, Delilah, I've got so much left to say, if every simple song I wrote to you would take your breath away, I'd write them all. Even more in love with me, you'd fall, we'd have it all. Oh, it's what you do to me. 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 What you do to me. Thousand miles seems pretty far, but they've got planes and trains and cars. I'd walk to you if I had no other way. Friends would all make fun of us, we'll just laugh along because we know that none of them have felt this way. Well, I can promise you, by the time that we get through the world, we'll never ever be the same. And you're to blame.
like to tell me like why and I need to know. <laughs> I'm just so annoying. <coughs> you people already know that. I don't tell them. I don't I don't really I wish you said that here. Fuck you. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect. Next up is a wonderful Bollywood tune called Barso Ray. Um, we watched the music video the other day, and it's just so fun. And uh, uh, it, it would be appropriate if it started raining, right? That's what it means, right? Yeah, so. so hopefully this song doesn't call the rain.
Celtics are on. <laughs> Sorry, everybody. Trust me. <laughs> I feel it, too. Okay. So. What? Okay. Anyway. Um, this next one is a lovely arrangement by two of our juniors who have displayed a particular amount of musical prowess. So it's so nice to see people arranging music their own. They're like, I want to hear that. So they just went on and did it. And so thank you very much, Evelyn and Dylan, for doing this. Thank you. <laughs> Yeah! Mon combat 
band called Sammy Ray and the Friends. It's called Whatever We Feel, and I kind of take it as, you know, life is yours for the taking. Do what you want with it, and yeah, go for it.
కనిపించని దేవుడ్నే కన్నార్పక చూస్తావే కన్నుల ఎదుటే నేనుంటే కాదంటున్నావే చూపే బంగారమాయనే శివుణ్ణి మాటే మాణిక్యమాయనే చూపే బంగారమాయనే శివుణ్ణి నవ్వే నవరత్నమాయనే అన్నిటికీ ఎప్పుడు ముందుండే నేను నీ వెనకే ఎప్పుడు పడుతూ ఉన్నాను అందరికీ ఎప్పుడు తల వంచని నేను నీ పట్టి చూసే తన్నుకు తలనే వంచాను ఇంత బ్రతుకు బ్రతికి నీ ఇంటి చుట్టూ తిరిగానే సుమంత నన్ను చూస్తే చాలు చాలనుకున్నానే అయినా చూపే బంగారమాయనే నీ స్నేహితురాలు మోస్తురుగుంటారు అందుకనే ఏమో నువ్వు అందంగుంటావు పద్యమనిది ఏలు వచ్చాయా చాలు నువ్వే కాదవ్వరైనా ముద్దుగుంటారు ఎర్ర చందనం చీర కట్టే లాలి కూడా రాకుమారే ఏడురాలు దుద్దులు పెడితే ఎవడైనా అందగత్తే అయినా చూపే బంగారమాయనే శివుణ్ణి మాటే మాణిక్యమాయనే చూపే బంగారమాయనే శివుణ్ణి నవరత్నమాయనే Okay, uh, as we approach our last two numbers here, uh, let's give it a round of applause for all of our performers tonight. Thank you guys so much for coming out. Uh, I'm so happy that it's beautiful weather. And, um, you know, and, and just consistently amazed at our students. And as you can see, we have some unbelievable musicians here. And uh, they inspire me every day. And Mr. Villano as well. Um, and also, just a reminder, this all has to go back inside. So, if you are willing and able to stick around for just a few minutes so we can all catch the second half of the Celtics game, that would be just amazing. Thank you, everybody, and enjoy Dylan Nelson. That's rich. When it's 
Can we get a round of applause for everyone that performed today? Um, well, Mr. Everard, obviously, I'd like to say thank you. Uh, you know, a million thank yous wouldn't be enough, honestly. I think, I think we'd all have the same, share the same sentiment. Um, I remember when we walked in, 
and Mr. Everard was like five minutes late. And then, and then he walked in his first day, and I, I was like, I was a freshman, so I already didn't know what was going on. And then Mr. Everard walks in, and he's like, you know, like galloping, all full of excitement. And and I was like, oh, this is gonna be an interesting year. And then it turned out to be four very interesting years. So thank you, Mr. Everard. Uh, you know this. <laughs> Thank you for your excitement. Thank you for the joy you bring to all of us. Thank you for, despite anything that might be going on behind the scenes, like, you're always, even if any of us are dealing with something, you're always there with a smile, and that really helps us, and we all really love, we all really love these past four years, and we're, we're all going to really miss you. I think Sophia would like to speak now. <laughs> Thank you, Anish. I think this might be enough, but, um... Okay. Um, I would also like to say thank you to Mr. Everard. Um, for the past four years, you've been, like, one of my favorite people ever. Um, and obviously, you're always there for everyone, and you're the best, and also only, but the best, nonetheless, chorus teacher I've ever had. <laughs> yes, emphasis on the best. But, um, just thank you for everything you've done, and, um, we will remember you forever. Definitely. Home CD. No. Okay. Thank you. I will be passing the mic to Connor Wood. <laughs> Never mind. We will be giving flowers as a token of our appreciation. <laughs> aren't nearly as good at talking, so they had to send the guy who also does chorus. <laughs> so, Mr. B, uh, you pretty much introduced me to music. Not really, but you really jump-started it. Not, look, look. I didn't say that quite right. <laughs> You want to speak? We clearly planned this very well. Uh, you put in so much work for the band. The band just simply would not happen without all the work you put in before school, during school, during school, when you're supposed to be doing other stuff, after school, way after school, weekends, weekdays, 24-7. All the work you put in, it really shows, and we really appreciate it. Uh, so obviously, none of this would have happened without everybody, HMAPA, and these two great guys right here who coordinated everything, and this past year, uh, Mr. B and Mr. Everard have done everything they can to make sure that we can have the best uh, music experience that we could have, especially for our last year of high school, and uh, although we share, we share the same name, Mr. B and I, every time somebody says, go what? And then this year they've tried to differentiate up by saying conductor Sean, and then now we both go what? <laughs> but uh, yeah, so none of this would have happened without them, and then let's give them all a round of applause. Um. So yeah, I do. I do actually hate to talk unless I'm talking to people like 18 or under. I seem to be fine, but, um, you guys, I, it, it, I, see, I'm having problems. Can you, can you understand what I'm saying? Uh, yes, they get it. I don't even have to make sentences anymore. This is why this works. Perfect. No, it's really dusty. No, I just, you, you guys make this all worth it. 1,000%. Thank you. And now i HHS Concert Band with yeah. Encanto.